It's a beautiful day. I'm down here at the Mississippi River Valley. With me I have uh, Mr. Lobo and Ookla. They're raring to go. Come on. No, Lobo. We're going to go this way. Good boy. They're in. The LSR when they first get up. Nope. Ookla. Ookla. Come on. Good boy. Beautiful day, last day of summer. Tomorrow's first day of fall equinox. You can see because the nights are getting cooler, so the vegetation's all starting to change. Ookla is about five months old now. around uh, 21 weeks. It's a moment uh, while we pause for Lobo. Come on, Ookla. Come on. Fortunately, he went right by the barrel. <laughs> Boy, Oak Man. A little bit peeing on everything. The stinging nettle they're eating. Getting their greens in. <laughs> like a standard poodle up here. Yeah. How you doing? Where you yeah, the big crossroads of the dogs here. <laughs> yeah, right. Come on, yeah, big guy. How you doing? Good. Beautiful Hi. dog. Come on, Ookla. Good boy. What's the dogs down here today? Yeah, 
Hey, how you guys doing? Come on, Nukla. <laughs> Come on. Good boy. You have a fun little man? Little big man? <laughs> Salad for a pup. He's a he's a very solid pup. He's built very muscular for a dog his age. I really like those. I like his build. Again, this is a. Uh, large wilderness off East Park and a beautiful day. I expect to see a lot of dogs here despite it being a weekday morning and not a weekend. up on the mighty Mississippi. How you guys doing? Good, how are you? Oh, enjoying the day. I like to let him meet people. I like to let him have those positive experiences with strangers and strange dogs. It's all helps to build his confidence. make a well socialized dog. Yeah, I'm keeping my eye open for a good stick for you, Lobo. Something that's not too long that you're going to snag me with. Yeah, he's just uh, 21 weeks old.
there goes Ukla. Ukla's first swim. Look at him going out after Lobo. See, that's why I like to have Lobo out with the puppies. Look at him go. Lobo, it's right there. Lobo lost sight of the stick. Look at Ukla go with him. Nice. Good boy. There you go. <laughs> so this is Ukla's first uh, real swim. He's weighted and stuff like that, but I haven't had him swim like this. Awesome. Good boy, Ook. <laughs> nice. Nice. Good boy. Does he want to go out again? Does he go out again? Yeah, there he goes. Look at him. He's a swimmer now. Nice. You gonna ride piggyback on Lobo there? <laughs> it went over, it went over the top of Lobo. It's so cool. I love it when I have uh, dogs that love to swim like that. Uh, looks like we got uh, Ryuki and uh, Ukla are both gonna be swimmers. Nice. You gotta work on getting your shake down though. You haven't quite got the shake down yet. <laughs> He's only getting the front half of his body shaken off. I watched some program once that made the uh, claim that uh, all dogs shake a little differently. That uh, the way a dog shakes is kind of unique to the dog. And then they uh, put up a uh, a ton of different uh, slow motion videos of dogs shaking off and all the dogs in the videos were shaking off differently but <laughs> I don't know if showing that proves the case but it was interesting thought I'd pass it along Somebody in a pontoon up off the point here fishing. Ukla, you want your own? Ow, Lobo. <laughs> it dropped off right before you could reach it. Good boy. He gets right to the drop-off point and then he springs off. <laughs> so cute. Good boy. Because it goes like this and then it just drops at this point here. It's a big drop-off. Awesome, he likes to swim. I'm happy to see that. Up until this point, he's been just a wader, you know, where they wade out. Swimming is such great exercise for him, so it's always, it's always fun to see them enjoy that. Great exercise for people, too. up here at the point. <laughs> Come here, Lobo. 
grab it. There you go. Good boy. Take your stick, Lobo. Ah, oh, it's all right. <laughs> I'm using them to teach my puppy to swim. This is the puppy's first time swimming. Oh, it is. Yeah. Doing well. Yeah. Yeah, he's just 21 weeks old. I'm Good. Miles, too far, bud. Miles, come. Hey, too far. Miles, come. I think his stick is right here. Yeah. I don't know that. Miles, bud. I usually just toss a rock by it when my dog's looking. <laughs> Handsome crew you got. Oh, thanks for shaking at me. Come on. The guys fishing over there. It's starting to get a little better. You still got to learn to shake the back half, though. Where should we go, guys? Should we go across? Solid is where you're standing, Lobo. Hmm. Oh, that looks pretty solid. Get out the way. Move. Move. Move, Lobo. Very good. Solid. It can be uh, kind of deceiving because the sun will dry the sand out here and you can walk on it, but then you'll have areas right by it where you'll sink up over your shoe. So guys, no, go on. I want him to whack me with that stick. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, I'm super psyched that uh, we got Ookla swimming now too, just like Ryuk. Beautiful, huh? Little boat's taking this time to uh, do a bathroom break. False alarms. <laughs> Come on. 
Up. Good boy, youth man. Come back down here to help me, Oak Man. Good boys. Chase the squirrel up the tree there. Come on, you ain't gonna get that squirrel. Hey, how you doing? Good, how are you? Oh, enjoying the day, it's beautiful. Oh, my Nice way to send out the summer. Take care. You can see Euclid is doing just what I want, you know, he's greeting people, being social with them and moving on and following along. That's what we like to see. the sirens to remind you that you're in the city and not in the wilderness <laughs> man.
Lobo just smacked me in the back with his wet tail. <laughs> Thanks, homie. Getting a little better at shaking off the back end there uh, with that one there, Toe. Or, uh, <laughs> Ookla. Stay up here where it's dry. All the mud's down there. They just got them cleaned off in the clean water. And now we'll take the high ground back. Thanks, let's go this way, guys. Good boy, you man. People are curious where Ukla's name comes from. See the dog over there. People are, might be curious where Ukla's name comes from. Uh, if you know the old uh, Thundar the Barbarian uh, cartoon, Ukla was uh, Thundar's beast man sidekick. Ukla the Mock. What do you got stuck to you? You got a burr stuck to you? Come on. humid cool and humid Get on some nettle before we leave. It's beautiful through here. 
the wildflower at the foot. Squirrel straight up the tree there. Well, if you've made it this far, I hope you've enjoyed it. I appreciate you watching. Like, subscribe, and share. All those things really help us out. Bye from the Uke Man and uh, Mr. Lobo. Oh, also check out our merch store. We got lots of cool merch. Good way to support the channel and get something cool in return. I just saw my uh, friend uh, Annika from Animal Watch is gonna feature uh, Ryuk on her uh, YouTube channel uh, this Friday, so that'll be fun to watch. Thank you, Annika. She's uh, featured Kurgan on her channel uh, uh, multiple times over the years. Matter of fact, uh, the first time she did that uh, really gave me a lot of subscribers and helped me grow. Uh, she's a very nice lady. Check out her channel, Animal Watch. Annika Svenska. Again, Ryuk will be on there uh, this Friday. for a second my sciatic is backed up. Hey guys wait a second. Good boy Mr. Ook man. hit by a truck on the job uh, years ago that's how my youtube channel started as a vlog of my recoveries and uh when you see me crouching down like that on my videos with the dogs i'm, I'm just uh relieving my sciatica from my uh my injury there's always people who try to give me helpful advice in the comments trust me i've uh i've done everything i've been through multiple chronic pain programs uh talk to surgeons I'm not a surgical candidate because I have too much degenerative stuff uh, from my time in the military as a infantry paratrooper so it makes a fusion not possible I have one level of my lumbar spine where uh, I have no disc at all it's just bone on bone and then uh, the other levels are all badly blown out and herniated and then my floating ribs on uh, my uh, left hand side are caved in from where the uh, truck hit me. Well, part of the dents and dings you pick up and getting older, I guess. <laughs> you don't get to take your body with you when you go, so keep it strong for as long as possible and uh, get the most use out of it while you can while you're here. At 55, I could be gone. Uh, next week or I could be here for uh, another 40 50 years you never know make the most of it while you can well here's where I gotta hook them up come here guys come on hooked up and ready for the climb out see ya like subscribe and share Tammy can't be here because uh, She's at work right now, but uh, she was. Uh, she'd say thanks for watching as well. Bye. Thanks for watching. Check out our merch store down below. <laughs>
Mm-hmm.